right, okay, so I have been spending an ungodly amount of time um, watching the boy names I love but won't be using videos because, well, I'm currently 25 weeks pregnant, almost 26, 20, almost 26 weeks pregnant with a baby boy, and I have yet to choose his name. <laughs> um, when we found out that we were pregnant, I knew right away that if it was a girl, I already knew what her name was going to be. And I said, if it's a boy, we are totally screwed because I have no idea. So it ended up being a boy, of course. <laughs> My luck. Um, and now I'm totally screwed out of the idea of what kind of boy name I want to use. Um, so I've been looking up a bunch of these videos and I thought I'd do my own on girl names I love but won't be using. Um, now this one doesn't include the name that I was going to name this baby simply because if we do go on to have a third child, I don't know, um, I, and it happens to be a girl, then I most definitely will be using that name. Um, so I, I kind of want to keep that on the down low. But these names I have down on here are also like really cute and I really like and they were either ones that I considered um, for a little bit with my first child Riley um, when I found out she was a girl or just names that I came across like in between then um, so here we go number one is Ellie and I really like this name because um, for one reason I associate with a cute little girl um, I used to live in California and there was a girl that did my hair and we kind of we don't really keep up, but I have her as a friend on Facebook, and she has a little girl, I think it's her youngest daughter, and um, her name is Ellie, and she's just the cutest little girl. She's got brown hair, and curly brown hair, and she's just, she's really pretty. So when I think of the name Ellie, I think of her. So I'm like, oh, that's a cute name, because it's a cute little girl. Um, the next one is Mia. I really like this name. Um... I really like it with the middle name Marie, which coincidentally is my middle name, and I hated having the middle name Marie growing up because, uh, like, everybody has the middle name Marie. Like, I guarantee you, like, you know at least three people with the middle name Marie. Um, it's very common, but I feel like Mia Marie is just, it's short, cute, simple, just very dainty. <laughs> um, but yeah, the next one is Lexi. Now, I really like this name, but I would never name my kid Lexi simply because in high school, there was a lot of Lexis. So I feel like it's one of those names where um, they'd be like, Lexi, and like five people would turn around and be like, huh? What? <laughs> um, so it's just, it's really common. Uh, the next one is Brickell. I really like this name, um, and I've only heard of it, I've only heard of one person named Brickell. Um, she was a scene model or a site model back in 2007 or 2008, I believe. I'll put a picture of her if I can find one. Um, I think now she does, she's really popular on Instagram and she does like makeup and stuff. Um, but I really like that name. Uh, the next one is, um, uh, Stella. Now when I say this name, I normally get two different reactions. Either somebody says, like, oh, that's really cute, or they say, like, Oh, that sounds like a showgirl slash porn star name. <laughs> um, now, when I think of it, I think of this little girl that I used to teach. Um, and she had blonde, curly, curly blonde hair and bright blue eyes. And she was the sweetest little girl ever. And um, she was just, she's really cute. So that's what I think of when I think of the name Stella. Um, again, kind of the whole name association with Ellie. Um, but yeah, obviously none of my kids would have blonde hair and blue eyes because I have black hair and Jake has black, uh, brown, black hair. If our kid came out with blonde, curly hair, I think people would be side-eyeing me. Like, um, Jake, you might want to get a paternity test. Um, <laughs> but I don't know. I really like the name anyway. Um, the next one is... Addie. I think this one's cute. When I think of the name Addie, I think of like a a girly girl, but still like tomboyish. Like a tomboyish girly girl. Um, I don't know why. I just do. Uh, the next one is Scout. Again, this is another one that I've only heard of one person named Scout, or one girl named Scout. Um, she played in Rob Zombie's Halloween movie. Um, she's really pretty. She's gorgeous. Um, I'll try to put a picture of her too. Um, 
and she's the only person I've ever heard of that's named Scout, and I just, I really like, I really like that name. I think it's cute. I think it's kind of like um, naming your kid, your girl, your daughter, um, Ryan. I don't know. It's just like, it's edgy, and it's cute, and it's kind of like unexpected. Like, like when you hear like somebody named Scout, like, you're just like, oh, your name's Scout. Like, I've never, you know. Like, I feel like Ryan's becoming more common as a girl name, but you, you get what I'm saying. Edgy. Um, the next one is Lexa. I don't really know why I like this. It's kind of a variation of Lexi. So, I guess for the same reason I like the name Lexi. I just like, I just like the way it sounds. Um, the next one is Allie. Now, I like the name Allie um, simply because I like the way it looks when it's written out. Um, which is weird because my name's Angie, so I always hated having an A as the first letter of my name because I didn't know if I wanted to write it as a sharp A or a rounded A or a cursive A, but I feel like no matter which way you write the A with Allie, the rest of it just flows so nicely that it looks pretty. But specifically with a cursive A, and then it flows into the L, L, I, E, and then, you know, it just looks so pretty written out on paper, which is how I picked out, that's how I chose my daughter Riley's name too. Um, it was just the way it looked, I liked the way it looked written out on paper. Um, <laughs> so that's a, that's a big thing to me, I guess. Okay, and the last one is kind of, it's very hippie. Um, it's Marlo. I feel like it's a mix between Marley and I guess Harlow. Um, Marlo. I think it's really cute, especially with the middle name, <laughs> with the middle name Breeze. <laughs> Marlo Breeze. I feel like that's so cute. But then again, it's really hippie, like I said. So I would never actually name my kid Marlo Breeze just because I wouldn't want her to have um, the whole like, oh, your parents must be hippies. Uh, response her entire life, but I do think it's really pretty. I do think it's really pretty, Marlo Breeze. I don't know, something about it, it's just really cute. Um, uh, and then I have three extra ones that I thought I'd throw in here. Um, the first two are because I think they sound really cute as like elderly women names, um, and so I can like picture my um, my daughter long after I'm dead when she's growing old and do her elderly is being in like a nursing home or something um, with the name um, Jade and Claire. I think both of those names are very like elderly woman cute. Um, and then the last one, it's gotten so popular. I, I wrote this one down back in 2015 when I was pregnant with my daughter. Um, it's Everly. I feel like it was popular back then, but I feel like it's even more popular now. Um, but I also feel like most people spell it E-V-E-R-L-I-G-H. Um, but I like it spelled out E-V-E-R-L-E-E. -E -E. I like the double E's for some reason. My daughter's name is Riley, spelled R-Y-L-E-E. -E. Um, I don't know, something about the double E's. I just really like them. Um, but yeah, so that's technically 13. And um, hopefully, after we figure out baby boy's name, then I can come back and do a 13 or a 10 um, baby boy names I love, but won't be using after we decide his. But I can't do that now because I haven't decided yet. So <laughs> pretty much any names up for up for grabs with a boy right now. Um, but yeah, those are 10, or I guess technically 13 baby girl names I love, but won't be using simply because I'm having a boy. Um, anyway, thank you so much for watching. You wanna come say bye? Yeah. This is Riley! Hi. You say hi! 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 <laughs> this is my Riley's guy. She's the cutest. Mwah! Her and her flippy shirt. Love you.